learn about rational and irrational numbers. Rational numbers are the numbers that can be written in a simple fraction or the ratio of two integers. Examples of rational numbers are 1.2 can be written as 12 over 10, which is equal to 6 over 5. 6 over 5 is a simple fraction, so this means that 1.2 is a rational number. Another example of a rational number is the number 4. 4 can be written as the fraction 4 over 1. 4 over 1 is a simple fraction, so 4 is a rational number. Another example of a rational number is 0 0.666. fraction two-thirds. Two-thirds is a simple fraction. So this means that 0 0.666 dot 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 is a rational number. Irrational numbers are the numbers that cannot be written as a simple fraction or the ratio of two integers. So, Examples of irrational numbers are pi is an irrational number. Pi is equal to 3.14159 dot dot dot. 3.14159 is an, a number that cannot be put into a simple fraction or cannot be made into a simple fraction because this number never ends and does not have a repeating pattern. So, pi is an irrational number. Another irrational number is the square root of 2. The square root of 2 is equal to 1.4 one, four, two, dot, dot, dot. One point four one four two, dot, 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 cannot be put, cannot be made into a simple fraction because it never ends and it does not have a repeating pattern. So this means that the square root of two is an irrational number. Famous irrational numbers are number and the golden ratio. Let's write the golden ratio a little bit. And the golden ratio. Now let's find out whether some numbers are rational numbers or irrational numbers. Let's first start with the number The square root of 30. Then let's find out whether 22 over 7 is a rational number or an irrational number. Then let's find out whether 3.777 dot 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 is a rational number or an irrational number. Then let's find out whether 5.15, 5.18, 1818, dot dot dot, 
is a rational number or an irrational number. Let's first start by finding out whether the square root of 30 is a rational number or an irrational number. The square root of 30 is equal to 5.47. 4, 7, 7, 2, 7, 2, 2, 5, 2, 5, 5, 7, 5, 7, dot, dot, dot. The number 5.47722557, dot, 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 never ends and does not have a repeating pattern. So, this means that the square root of 30 cannot be put into a fraction or cannot be made into a simple fraction. So the square root of 30 is an irrational number. Now let's go to the next example, 22 over 7. 22 over 7, we know that 22 over 7 is a fraction. And we know that rational numbers are the numbers that can be made into a simple fraction. So 22 over 7 is an irrational number. It is a rational number because it is a simple fraction. So let's write 22 over 7 down here. 22 over 7. Now let's go to the next example. 3.177 dot dot dot. 3.17, I mean 3.777 dot 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 can be made into a fraction. The fraction for 3.777 dot 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 is 170 over 45. 170 over 45 is not a simple fraction, but it can be made into a simple fraction. So, 3.777 dot 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 is a rational number. 3.777 dot 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 is a rational number. Now let's go to the last example. 5.181818 dot dot dot. 5.181818 does have a pattern. Dot dot dot. Does have a pattern. So this means that 5.181818 is a rational number. So, 5. Point, 5. 5.181818 dot 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 is a rational number. Today we learned about rational and irrational numbers. Thank you for watching this video.